Hello everyone, my name is John Borodine, and today we're going to learn how to make Harry Potter wands. Um, here's a couple of examples. Um, you can make them into any design that you wish. This is just an, an idea. It's all up to you. I want everyone to be creative. Now what you will need is, uh, is chopsticks. You can get these at any uh, Japanese restaurant or sushi restaurant. Right, glue gun, be sure to have glue in it though as well. Also, paint, paintbrush, and some water. Now, before you begin, though, be sure you have some newspaper and computer paper just so you don't make any messes. Now, the first thing to do is to start setting up a pattern. Um, here's, a, here's one way I do it. It's just... Uh, take it slow, though. You smear it up and down. Although if you're going for like spirals, be sure to take, be sure to have patience. Otherwise you will smear the glue. It will be uneven and we don't want that at all. Unfortunately, I'm already starting to run out of glue, so be sh that's another thing too. Be sure that you have enough for the design and pattern that you wished on the wand. Okay, that should do. Uh, this will t streak a little bit. Now, however, this will take like up to three to five minutes to dry. So once you wait, once it's fully dried, then we can start painting. Okay, now that it's uh, officially done drying, we can start painting it. Now for this one though, I'm going to use some brown and some silver paint. First, just make sure the, the brush is completely clean off. Now, if case that you come across some spots that's really hard to paint with the brush, I recommend using a Q-tip to get to those little, uh, little corners and spots that you can't that you'll miss just so everything's painted okay for the handle though i think uh we'll go with silver be a little interesting now when you paint though you want to like you want to have an even coating so some places where you did paint you might want to paint need to paint again just so you don't see any uh wood show Now for the drying process, the drying process on this, I would say about like 10, maybe 18 minutes, just to be sure. Okay. Sorry about that. What are your thoughts? Are there any kind of designs that you would like to do on a wand? Uh, if so, please leave your comments in the comment section. Be sure to hit like and subscribe. And thank you for watching. I hope you all have a great day.